the artwork was done uh, again with hypnosis, but with Peter Christopherson. We did this uh, in New York, and again it was um, cold and snowy. And Storm had had the idea of the nails tearing away at the paper of the image. We recorded the second album in Holland, and Robert Fripp, who I was working with at the time, was very keen to, to try really speeding up my recording process, as many people have been since and failed. <laughs> but he got closest to it. On the second album, we started to get to know each other a lot more as musicians, and uh, Tony Levin, Larry Fast, and Robert Fripp were the only people from the first album that were sort of carried over into the second album. There was less people in the studio, and we started in this sort of isolated environment of the Dutch uh, studio to interact in, in a different way. And I think some of the band chemistry began to form. Tony Levin also introduced me to Jerry Morotto, who played a big part in the early records, as did Larry Fast, who was all the textures he was providing and the synthesizers. So I think that touring band started really evolving and getting its own style. The tour for this record uh, was one in which we were all dressed in sort of road workers' uh, fluorescence. This was, uh, I think, in the um, early days of, of punk. We used to do a sort of punk version of uh, Whiter Shade of Pale, which has probably safely eroded in the midst of time. And uh, a version of Me and My Teddy Bear, which I think was the first song that I performed as a kid and um, was one of the few songs that I could remember the words to. <laughs> 